We're going to go to the Gazette to see why they're covering this out-of-state guy more than they're covering our local guy. Mr. Lynch, I'm Greg Hughes. Hi, Jay. Hi. How are you? All right, good. Let me give you a card, okay? As you know, I'm a candidate for Congress in District 1, mm -hmm. and, and uh, I'm just kind of confused. I have to tell my face like I'm getting ignored from everything. Uh, you know, you're doing stories about the other candidate lives out of state, and nothing mm -hmm. about me, and, and then you've had some stories with the court issues, and that's kind of my expertise. The court issues, of course, the issues. Yeah, I've run a pro se association for 12 years to help people represent themselves in court after some of the bad attorneys and judges that we have on the bench. Uh, you know, I have documented evidence of some of the stupid things that they do. Mm -hmm. But it seems like, I, you know, my opinion isn't mattering much, and then the Gazette just is kind of ignoring that. And I just well, don't know why. <coughs> I think you've run before, haven't you? Yes, I ran for governor. Matter of fact, when you had the, the comment thing in there about I didn't respond, I never got a questionnaire. And you guys didn't even put a picture put of me. Put an online board right. guy. Yes, and then you actually put in the election paper, too. Okay. And I was surprised there wasn't even a picture of me that you had from my gubernatorial candidate in 2010. And so, uh, you know, I kind of ignored that, but yet it seems like I'm still getting ignored on everything. And I'm just trying to figure out you, why that is. Including by the voters. Huh? No. Including by the voters. No, not, a, not at all. Not at we all. had an event the other night. 33 people showed up. We asked KCRG, KJ, and to cover it. Right. Nobody yeah. showed up. Right. Yeah. Um, I mean, you've run before. You need like 10, 5, 5, 1. Um, have you seen all the yard signs around? I've seen all the yard signs. Uh-huh. Okay. 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 You've tried, you've uh, and you haven't, just near as I can tell, you haven't built any support among okay. the voters. Okay. Uh, could that be because he's not getting any media coverage? Okay. I think it could. Contribute to it? I mean, have you, you're welcome. I don't know what you're doing for your campaign, I don't know what you're doing for your advertising. Or well, you've, you've never heard of so many yeah. things but that people can't yeah. do. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Not true. And how did you measure that? Though? Look at the poll. The what poll? Election results. Okay, but how in this election here? Because okay, I mean, I disagree with you. My gubernatorial candidate, you know, I had 3,600 votes for me. But at the same time, look at my cost per vote versus brand staff. I mean, it's tough when you're up against 14 million dollars. Right. You know, first off, if I had 14 million dollars, I wouldn't even be running for office. I'd be out of town. I'd be living in Costa Rica. And it's the same thing here. Jim, I just choose not to put a lot of money into this thing. I mean, I put my own money and not asking for money, and the support has been overwhelming, especially from the BFW halls and things like that. And I just don't understand why I'm getting ignored. And I'm, I'm trying to figure out if, if you know, there's some type of action I have to take you know, to, to make the Gazette tell the full story. That's all I'm not asking. I'm not asking them to taint it one side or another, but you know, how do they know that there's another candidate when you put something in there that so did not reply? And I'm telling you right now, I never got it, the questionnaire. Okay. It was never sent to me. You know, and so, I mean, I, I've ignored that, but at the same time, it's like, well, that's for me. I've, I've got a question. I mean, there's absolutely no support for this crawl guy. Nobody even knows him, yet he's been talked about twice. He's, I mean, it's, it's a case of where it's just an interesting story just because nobody knew. Really? Somebody from New Jersey could be running in Iowa. Uh, yeah, yeah. How somebody from out of state runs here. So, um, yeah. Um, what's your schedule like next week? I'm open. What okay. What do you need? I know Monday is out for me. Okay. Um, why don't I give you a call either Monday or Tuesday and we'll set something up. Um, now, I wrote is that the best number to reach you at? This? Six right here. Yeah. Right here. Right. Uh, I wrote a letter to the editor. I haven't seen anything about that. I emailed them again today to make sure that they got it. I thought it followed okay. on all the guidelines, but I haven't seen anything. You got that email because I sent it to you. So is that Jamie? Do you know if that's going to get published? or is it? I, I don't know. I mean, Good. How are you? It's an opinion sure. page editor handles that, so I, okay. I don't keep up with the editor in most cases. 
like that until they come out. Uh, yeah, and I'll give you a call, and we can set something up. You, and you're right around here. I mean, you're in town close to Well, I'm out. I got 20 counties I'm trying to yeah. cover, so you know, okay. it's kind of tough. I live okay. behind True Value on Mountain Road, so I'm not far away. All right, I'll give you a call. And I'm getting ready to file a suit against a small claims court magistrate. I would hope that you guys would think that would be an interesting story too, because you don't see judges get sued very often. Wow. So, but I'm getting ready to file a suit against a small claims court magistrate. Okay. So, and the state of Iowa, so I got to sue them along with that. Okay. So hopefully uh, you guys will pick that up. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, but uh, yeah, if you would call me, I will make myself available for you. Okay. Okay. All right. Thanks, Thanks Greg. Thanks. Uh,